Hey guys, Romano, I see you're still here working. Hi, how are you? I'd like to go over two simple pH calculations that is a sure bet for the DAT or the OAT exam. So come over and let's have a okay, look. Okay, Dr. Romano. Now, this is a standard type of question which 100% is likely to land on a test. If the pH of an unknown acid is 4, find the OH minus concentration. Well, we should know the pH and the POH equals 14. So if the pH is 4, the POH would be 10. And then all we would simply do is to take this 10 and raise it to the power of 10. So the OH minus would be 1 times 10 to the minus 10th. That's a standard question, and that's pretty straightforward. Part B, if the hydronium concentration is 2 to the minus 6th molar, let's put molar in, find okay. the pH. Now, we all know pH is minus the log of the hydronium ion concentration. So minus the log of 2 to the minus 6th. Now, if it was 1 to the minus 6, the answer would be 6, because you would simply raise it to the power of 10. But since this is a 2, that means the answer will be a little bit less than 6. So minus the log of 2 to the minus 6 would be 5.7. Now, just to make sure you understand, what if I would have said this concentration was, say, 7 to the minus 6? Well, as you can see, a 7 is really far away from the number 1. So that means if it was 1 to the minus 6, it would be 6. But 7 to the minus 6, you're going to come down a lot. So that would be up around 5.2. So I hope you can get a feel for how to do these logarithms. Um, this is a sure bet type of question you're going to see on the exam. All right, I hope this helps on how to go about doing a problem involving logs and pH. Good day. Thank you, Dr. Romano. I'm on the Instagram group. Aren't you happy? I'm very happy. Good day to you. Good day to you, sir. Bye-bye.